they feed on things like earthworms, and they get most of their earthworms in open pasture. So they come out of the woods and forage on fields. Um, they sometimes forage in the woods themselves because they eat all sorts of things. They're very, very Catholic in their diet. Mm. They'll eat insects, worms is the principal food supply, but they'll eat young rabbits, they'll eat carrion, anything that's dead, left lying around, snails and so on, invertebrates. Um, so a great deal of variety of food is taken. And of course, they need access to all sorts of different habitats to be able to get those foods at different times of the year. Do they eat plants or not? They will eat plants. Um, they eat, for example, they'll eat your garden produce. They eat beetroot, they'll eat peas, they'll eat potatoes, yeah. strawberries. They love strawberries. So they'll do a lot of damage in people's gardens. Um, but the main food supply of the natural types are the fruits and nuts that they can find in the, in the woods and in the hedgerows. Mm. So they'll eat yew berries, they'll eat elderberries, they'll eat hazelnuts. Um, so anything, the fruits and nuts that are around in the countryside are very, very, very good food sources for badgers. Mm. And presumably that, that changes as the year progresses with certain berries becoming available. I was up on the common last uh, October, I think it was, and I saw badger latrines, they were badger poo in a, in, a, in a hole or a latrine, and um, it looked as though there were real berries in there, whereas earlier in the year I'd seen some some uh, carapaces of the, what's another word for carapace, what, um, how would you say that? The uh, shells the, of beetles? The shells of beetles, the yeah. very purpley beetles. Yeah, that's right. Um, Maybe dung beetles. Dung beetles, yeah. It's very easy to tell what badgers have been eating by looking in their feces and yeah. their poo. Yeah. And uh, you can see a muddy, even consistency usually indicates they've been eating earthworms. Oh, okay. You can't see right. the worms, you just see the muddy, yeah. sloppy stuff that's left. Yeah. Um, if they've been eating cereals, wheat, barley, oats, they usually come through virtually intact. Um, snails, you get bits of snail shell in the droppings. Oh. Hazelnuts, you get bits of hazelnut shell in the oh. droppings. Um, so it is easy to see. Yew berries are very, very obvious because they're red, mm. and the ro the dropping is actually quite bright red to look oh, at. Oh, okay. And you get the little yeah. remains of the yew berry seeds in there as well. Yeah. But um, yes, you can look in the latrines at a particular time of the year, and you'll see very different foods being eaten. Mm. Mainly, earthworms are their principal food supply. And if it's reasonably damp, the grass, and um, not too cold, the earthworms come out at night to feed on the mm. surface. Mm. Of course, badgers are nocturnal, and they forage by moving around the fields at night, and they smell the earthworms on the surface. And they pick them up, they snatch them with their incisors, which meet very finely. Mm -hmm. They pick up the earthworm and pull it out of its burrow, because they usually have their tail just stuck yeah. in the burrow. Yeah. And they'll eat a lot of earthworms. And I watched one badger one night, and in the space of 90 minutes, it ate nearly 1,000 earthworms. <laughs> That's incredible. And they were quite big earthworms. Why? They were picking them up almost, you know, every other second, yeah. picking up an earthworm and its stomach was visibly distended. It was a bit like a barrel yeah. at the end of 90 wow. minutes. It just went and slept it off. That's incredible. Mm. Goodness.